Oh, there we go. Welcome back to make way for Cat. We just took the ferry across and we are back. Ferry weather, if you want to take the ferry, just climb aboard and I'll open the gate. You been through Stonefall Crossroads recently? Seems like the monsters get tougher as you head up that way. If you ever wander into an area where the monsters are too tough for you, there's no shame in coming back later, after you've improved your weapons and armor. Stone Fell Crossroads, so we are going east, which is to the right. Alright, let me adjust this volume again. Ooh. Uh, those snails run. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, yeah, we're gonna just go right down by him. We want to explore this area a bit. Oh, oh my goodness. You can't come through here. This is the top secret base of the amazingly tough pirate crew called the Dream Cannons. We'll blow yours up if you mess with us. Okay. Fair enough. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna go to Arrowmouth. Pardon, ignore me. Turn Marsh. Oh, look at those uh, ghostly boys. Ugh. Yes, it is on fire. Hello. Also has a distance punch. Wow, okay. Oh, that uh, potion we had. Uh, it would help if I actually use my sword and not the roll action. Alright, he takes quite a few hits to bring down. I'm just gonna try to skate through. Ooh, you're new. Okay, so there's a little house here. Is this the distillery? Oh, uh, hey. This is the Marsh Meadery. Oh, nope. Are you looking to stock our mead for your tavern? My family owns a tavern, actually, but no, I'm hunting pirates right now. Oh, you're in the Volunteer Navy, aren't you? I, uh, could you help me? My boss, Michael, wants me to get some hornet honey. But the hornets are super dangerous. Not that I'm saying you shouldn't be careful, but if you happen to see any in the marsh, and I know you're busy, but if you see some hornet honey, could you bring it by? I'll pay you 45 crowns. Ooh. That's the boss. Michael the Mead Maker. I am Michael, the mightiest mead maker, and this is Marsh Meadery. Do you have any proof? <laughs> any, any proof of what now? I thought not. Now scramble off, puny girl. Is it an alcohol pun proof, or are you trying to see if I'm 21? Yes, in the US, the drinking age is still 21. <laughs> Yarrow mouth, we made it. Statue seems to be missing its beak. Uh oh. Is there a FNAF reference here? Chica missing her beak? So 
So Briarwood Distillery has a secret mushroom spot up in the woods, except I hear it's been overrun by monsters. Bet if you were handy with a sword, you could make a few crowns taking care of that. I bet I could. You explored the Puzzlewood west of town. There's an old structure built by the bear warriors. They say one of their relics is hidden inside. Sounds like a dungeon. History lesson. That's the sword of the last chieftain of Yarrowmouth. He dropped it there when he was killed by the Sea King. It's pretty cool, but most tourists are just interested in Briarwood Distillery, which is in the northwest corner of town. Okay. Neat. Oh, welcome to the Apothecary. I'm your village healer. Need anything for your ailments? Uh, yes I do. Crafting table? Ah, <gasps> there we go. Potion of magic restoration. Early blade potion. Oh, we need three of those. Seeker eyes. Salt candles. Elixir Vitae. Need one more of those seagrass looking things. Let's do the Burly Blade Potion. Ah, sorry, I'm jumpy. I'm a carrot shipper by trade, but this pirate crew has been attacking me. I asked the town's volunteer navy woman to help me out, but now the pirates want to come see me to chat. So yeah, with so many carrots on the line, I'm pretty nervous. Can I... those apple trees, though? Southeast of town, there's a place called Kingsdown Isle. There's some pirates living in an old fort there. The Kingsdown is so much of a pain to travel to. They don't really bother us, since the road from Turn Marsh is blocked off. I think the only way there is taking the raft along Snapma Sta Snapmast Reef, east of here. New face in Yarrowmouth. Did you come to check out the distillery in the northwest? Well, I have a look around. I have some items that might be handy for you. Yes. Looking to sell? Not particularly. A moment. Hey, sorry, I can't take on any more work. Hey, wait. Are you in the Navy volunteer? Me? I don't... My dad was training me to join, but we never finished. I guess not really. Hon, it's a volunteer Navy. If you volunteer, you're in. You look like you've already accomplished some things you can be proud of. You know what? I've got a ton of work. I'll pay you to finish up this job for me. Simple task. Maybe beating up some pirates. I'm sure you can handle it. You want to help me? Sure. So here's the deal. A local man, Karlov, ships carrots. Uh-huh. He's being pressured by a pirate crew. Do some smuggling for the pirate council. The crew is called the Dream Cannons. Absurd name anyway. I torched their boat, and now they're ready to talk. Thing is, there's nothing to talk about. I'll pay you to meet them for me. Tell them to... You'll beat them up. Sure, go tell some pirates to leave this Korlov guy alone, or I'll smack them around. I can manage that. Excellent. The meeting place they picked is at Seaweed Rock in Turn Marsh. It's on the west side of the marsh. Go get them. Um, upgrading your sword or bow with coral ore. I don't have 50 crowns at the moment. Armoring shop. Okay, not yet. If you bring me one, I would craft you more marvelous armor. Ooh, so that's the puzzle. Puzzle forest. I'd have to take a peek at that. Oh, here's the distillery. Ah, uh, uh, oh no, I messed up. What's going on, buddy? So Briarwood's rival, a mead maker, we don't like him. He's underhanded and stuff, so I thought maybe we could, uh, maybe we could out-compete him on the market and make our own mead. So I got a whole bunch of bees. Well, kinda. I actually accidentally got a whole bunch of hornets. It's bad. They've infested the whole barn. It's dangerous. Hey, you've got a sword. I'll pay you 40 crowns if you can destroy all of these hornet nests for me. All right. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, there, there you go. Like, when are they gonna come out? I do want some hornet, honey. Hey. Oh. Hope if I didn't stay so close. Eh. Whatever. Oh! How did one spawn? Ooh, coral ore. You did it. You took care of all those hornets' nests. Hives. Oh, oh man. That was a bad idea. Anyway, 40 crowns. Yep. Rohit, hey, it looks like you're part of a volunteer navy. Can I pay you to do something for me? Our local volunteer is super busy. Tell me about it. Fantastic. See, we sometimes use mushrooms to flavor our whiskey here. It's a special technique that's hard to copy because you need particular mushrooms, but lately our mushroom picking spot has been overrun by monsters. Pay you 65 crowns if you can go clear out the creatures. Yes. Um, head through the puzzle wood on the western edge. Up some stairs is the spot. You'll need this key to open the gate. Cool. Some people still call Yarrowmouth the Isle of Thorns. It's partially because of the briars that grow here, and partially because the people who lived here long ago were known for fighting with spears, also for being pretty thorny in their personalities. Can I help you? You might be able to. I'm tracking a crew of pirates. They fly an hourglass on their flag. They left a bunch of empty bottles and briarwood gin at a place they sacked. Thought you guys might be able to point me in their direction. Oh, the hourglass crew. Yeah, they're regulars. Their hideout isn't far from here, but I don't know exactly where. You'd have to ask Jera. He went up to the Juniper Grove quite a while ago, come to think of it. Here, take the key and go check on him. The Juniper Grove is by the dock. Head northeast out of town. Okay. Lots to look at. You can find your way through Puzzlewood. There's a glade filled with either statues or, well, there's these stone figures. They're called the Silent People. Nobody knows where they are or where they came- what they are or where they came from. Creepy! I love it. You look like a pretty tough monster fighter, huh? Hey, if it ever becomes too easy for you, I heard rumors of a place east of Goat's Head Harbor through a cave. There's a ravine where it constantly rains. Oh, okay. I remember someone else talked about that too. Uh... That looks like an offering. Okay, can't go through there. Hmm. Ah, seeing if I could get through. Oh, that almost came out of nowhere. It's down this way. Oh, yep. Could use all these crowns to upgrade armor and stuff. Giant spider bro. Oh, no. Ooh, those are bigger bats. Excellent, I'll take all the crowns. Cool. Ooh, nice. De increased by two. I will take that. I can definitely use more armor. East Yarrowmouth Pier and Juniper Grove. So that's this way.
Okay, we got some snail bros. I have a feeling if I touch those thorns, it's gonna hurt. Lily! Oh, hey! Anyway, you want to ride somewhere? No, not yet. I do want those bushes, so let's take care of this guy. I don't... Yeah, I hit the... Hit the bushes. Lily is just chilling. Okay. I have a feeling we're going to be fighting something here. Gate is locked. Oh, he locked himself in. Hi! Didn't I try to fight something like this somewhere else? Wait for him to charge. Oh! Look at you throwing fireballs and stuff. Excellent. Lavender. Great. Jero. Jera. Okay, this is great. I was really hoping someone would come along and defeat that monster. I've been trapped up here hiding from it for a day and a half. Who are you anyway? Kilia, and I think you might be able to help me. I'm tracking the hourglass pirates and I heard you might know where their hideout is. Those guys? Ugh. Yeah, their hideout is on Kingsdown Isle. The bridge is usually locked, but I know a secret way in. There's these old catacombs you can cut through if you had the key. The leftmost pillar near the bear statue has a hidden keyhole, but I don't know where the key is. I think Olin used to have it, but it got stolen by pirates. Anyway, I'm going to head back to the distillery. If you want dis directions again, come see me. Okay, so I think the key that we got that our father lost is probably for that. this bear statue. Uh, come on. Hmm. I do remember seeing another bear statue, though. Oh, this one. I'm gonna have to talk to him again. Another bear statue? A lot of bear statues. This... Um, there's a raft that'll take you there east of town, so south before you get to the dock in Juniper Grove. Then on the island- oh, on the island! Okay, so you gotta take the raft. Okay. Not ready to go anywhere yet. I'll ask him for directions later, but we do want to head over to- Whatever this is. Awesome. And... Actually, we can go to the armor and get some more defense and some... Another upgrade. Oh, that's puzzle wood. I suspect I may need a full episode for puzzle wood. Hey, this stuff. I was looking for more of that. We could make another one of those Vitae potions. Okay. Sword. I'd love some. It doesn't matter. My artistic inclinations lead me to craft armor from the iron pine cones alone. Their curves, their strength, they're magnificent and rare. Okay, so I have to wait for puzzle wood. Awesome. Double upgrades on the sword. Uh, I think the apothecary was in this house here. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
You know, I keep forgetting that I have this. That is supposed to be defense. Okay. So we have about 10 minutes left of this episode. I'm going to go back down into the marsh. There was a meeting point. We got a bunch of quests here. Well, let's do some saving. Hornet honey. Probably not an ambush. Meet with some pirates. Seaweed rock in West Turn Marsh. Okay. 80? Yeah. Turn Marsh, so west. We're going left. Oh. Uh, it would help if I actually used my sword. Instead of just trying to run through here. Loving the sword, though. Okay. Oh! There we go. Someone in my comments did tell me I can jump gabs. So there we go. Oh, wow. Okay, they cast it right at you. Uh, we're going straight. Going straight. Oh. Ooh, more of these. Excellent. Why did you go like that? Straight. There you go. Ooh. We can make some more of that Vitae potion. Oh, yeah. Let's take care of that. Oh. You are frustrating. Kings Down Isle. That's how you get there. Ugh. You guys are awful. Can you just charge me? Awesome. All right, where's this seaweed rock? All right, let's go here, here. This is hard. Ah, all right. I'm in Turn Marsh in the western portion. Seaweed Rock in the West Turn Marsh.
What? Why? Oh, right into him. Great. Well, I do remember there's a, uh... One of those dream cannon pirates up here. Okay. Okay, bird. I guess that's it. It's gotta be somewhere in here. In that, uh... In the marsh. Take one of those. Oh, let's go talk to him. He's got some money for us for uh, killing hornets. Now I hop across here. Nope. Guess I gotta go around. These guys are made of seaweed, so isn't the seaweed rock over here then? Oh, no. Oh. There we go. I think right up there would be considered seaweed rock. Let's turn this in. Awesome. Here we go. Are you Karlov? No, you're not Karlov. No, but I'm here to talk to the Dream Cannon Pirate Crew on Karlov's behalf. Huh, well, that can work. Alright, follow me. Definitely not an ambush. What? The door's shut. This really is an ambush situation. Come on. Thought I'd come down here and see how things went. Did you knock some head in, heads in? Ugh, I did, but not the pirate heads. It was an ambush. They shoved me in a cave full of monsters. Those goat-witted salt drinkers. Well, you're fine, obviously, but we need to send a thank you note for that one. Look, I hate to ask more of you, but I know you can handle it, so I will. Can you go to the Dream Cannon crew's hideout and smack them down? Well, and for you. You're the one they ambushed. Sure, I'd like that. Actually, where is their hideout? I know where it is. Go get them. Mm, I have to go around. But I think that's about time, so thank you for watching. And when we come back, we are going to knock some dream cannon pirate heads in and take a look at the puzzle forest. So I'll see you then.